Oh my goodness, she is so cute. Hey guys, it's Brenda from my Wee Boo Burns Cradle. Today I have a new type of doll for myself. She is called the Adora Toddler Time doll. And I'll just show you the box. Now I've never purchased Adora before and I really think they're so cute. And I really wanted to see what she was like. So I bought her from Amazon, and I think I, her sculpt name, um, I don't think it says in here. Um, she came with this. It's a doll care. And, um, I'm sorry, the, okay, wait, my camera. These are the different types of dolls. Car seat shoes. I think they're all so sweet. But I will be honest here while I'm showing you this catalog. Um, Adora, Adora dolls are not a realistic reborn size. So if you're thinking of an inexpensive type of doll that could be like a reborn, these are not them. These are very small. Let's see. They're small dolls. They're more like, um, they're more like when your grandmother collects those porcelain dolls. All right. <clears throat> so I want to go over her very, very beautiful details. Very pretty. And um, sorry, the sun is shining. She is so super cute. And I have a name picked out for her already. But one, one question is, can she be turned into like a reborn? So let me just get the camera better for you and we'll see. So I will go over her details. Um, she is definitely just like a collectible doll. I do own some Ashton Drakes and I have replaced uh, bodies of the Ashton Drake onto a reborn body. And the reason why I got away with that is because the Ashton Drakes babies, realistic babies are more proportioned in size to a real baby. Now I'll take off her beautiful dress. Excuse my voice. And I love her outfit, by the way. These are like, I remember my grandmother made clothes using these little snaps and little hooks. <laughs> so this is kind of like homemade. Well, it's not homemade, but <clears throat> and I really want to see what her body will be like. Like the question is, is it possible to put her onto a reborn body and, you know, so that she's more realistic? Okay, I guess her dress is still attached to the bottom. Isn't she cute, though? I'm sorry about the sun. She is so sweet. And she does smell amazing. Um, this doll cannot turn her head or her arms. Like, they're not jointed. So, I mean, I love this doll as a collectible, and she's so cute, and I love how she smells. But as a reborn, I must admit, I will not buy this doll again. Um, like, trying to get that reborn baby doll fix for at a cheaper price. Oh, this, another, sorry, and I'm taking so long. 
<laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. So here's what her body. Let me take off her socks. Now the thing with Ashton Driggs for myself, and I'm not sure about Paradise Gallery, so I can't speak on behalf of those dolls. But I do know that the Ashton Drakes, if you want a reborn baby fix and can't afford the reborn price, an Ashton Drake is a really good alternative. These adore dolls for a reborn alternative, not a good idea. Like, look at the size of my hand. She is definitely a, a doll, a doll, a toy doll size. So, let's see. And her... Her vinyl is very different. It's not um, like Ashton Drake advertised as soft touch, realistic touch, real touch. And the, this isn't. This just feels like a doll. And I do appreciate that she has blushing. Like as a factory doll, this is a nice doll. But as a reborn alternative definitely not she is supposed to be a toddler and she is definitely not a true doll a uh, toddler size um i previously uh put a cuddle body onto one of my dolls and i will get her and i'll show you i'll compare the two i'll be back <laughs> and yeah my legs in the way um so here is a beautiful Adora doll. She is very cute. And I have a name picked up for her. Um, she is weighted slightly. Um, her hair is actually for a wig. It's so amazingly soft. I love her hair. Like her hair is. Uh, some, it actually feels better than some of my reborns. Like her hair is beautiful. And. I don't know if you can see that in focus. I don't I don't think my camera I locked it so it wouldn't go in and out. But I'll go over the details more with her. Um now here's my cuddle baby. She is um a newborn size, a true newborn size, a true realistic newborn size. And yeah. <laughs> so you can see. And this is her arms, her, well, she's on a cuddle body, but her legs. So this size is a true newborn. And sorry about the sun again. Um, hopefully it's not, hopefully it's not too much. So yes, that you can see now that she is very, very small. She is not a reborn, realistic reborn size at all. She is. Jerrica is. <laughs> She's sweet. I still love this little Adora doll. Now, at first I was thinking, should I put a reborn body on her? And now that I've received her and opened her, and the answer is no, I won't at all. Because if I put a reborn doll or body on her, like, this is only a newborn size, and definitely, like, her face is not a newborn at all. Not even close. It's, it's the size of a preemie baby. So, but I love her. She's so sweet. I'm not sending her back. I am disappointed that she is not realistically proportioned at all. Like, zero in the slightest. Um, but... She is very, very cute, and I will keep her in my collection. I have a name for her. And also, if you notice, um, like as a doll, these limbs could be the size of a newborn baby, and these legs could be the size of a newborn baby, but, and then we'd have to get rid of this head. So, because, yeah, it's just, she's not. She's not a realistic reborn at all. But let's see how her legs look. Let's see how this body looks. Oh, okay. So I do like the fact that she's... 
like on this interesting cloth body it's not too bad i mean the ashen drakes they're shaped different um but this as a reborn cloth body this is what they used to look like this is exactly like they had the legs like this um but we we're able to turn them and this one we can't we can a little bit The legs are not weighted at all. There's nothing in here. I don't even think that there's polyfill in here. No, the arms have nothing in her. <clears throat> Excuse my voice. I had recess duty yesterday <laughs> at the school. So I am, there's a lot of kids there. Um, so yeah, she has nothing in her limbs. She has a little bit of polyfill in here. I can feel the like joints, but we can't turn her arm because they're like completely attached here. She does have some like weight in her butt. It feels like a uh, bean bag material, a bit harder, this polyfill. Her hair is gorgeous. Oh, as as for a factory hair, her hair is so gorgeous. And I love her eyes. Okay, let's see. I'm just gonna. The sun is just like so bright. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's move. Oh. Like, her face is so stunningly sweet. Okay. Okay, I tried moving you out of the sun. And hopefully now you'll be able to see. Um, so, yeah, she's completely, like, nothing to hear. Look how cute she is, though. Um, her feet, I like this. Uh, I'm going to have one of my Ash and Drake's. I should compare also one okay in another video I will do a comparison video between her and the Ashton Drakes and a real reborn but look how cute she is oh I was talking about her hair her hair is so so soft like so pretty Let's see if I can get it how close her hair is very well done for a factory made doll. This is her back. Oh, it's so cute. Sorry, I got my my, my voice gets louder. But she is so sweet. Okay, can you see her beautiful eyes? She is so sweet and she has teeth up there. Her face is so cute. I love her. Now, can she sit on her own? Because she will not be added. Like, I keep track of all my Reborns. Their names, their scope name, and in order of when I receive them. She will not be on. She will not be on the list of my Reborns. Because she is totally not... Like my Ash and Drakes, they are added to oh, it's as low as I can go. Let's see if I take you off. Look. Okay, I'll move my tripod. Look how cute she is. <laughs> she is so sweet. Yeah, she will not be part of my reborn. I'll just keep her as a doll. I mean, I own some Lola Bella dolls, Lola Bella dolls. I own a baby born doll. I have many baby lives, and they're not part of my my um reborn list. So it's just I have my chase sculpt here. Oh, she's so sweet. I love her still. But like I'm saying, the point is, if you're looking for a reborn at a, a 
like inexpensive price a door dolls are not the answer um i would say ashton drake's now the chase is a newborn a true newborn see and then we have the adore doll the toddler doll oh she's so sweet wait i just have to pick her up oh my goodness oh, oh shit the chase sculpt you guys is so cuddly <laughs> she is so cuddly look now this is a true reborn size. Oh, oh she's look. Don't mind my Back to the Future shirt. I'm just lounging today. <laughs> okay. Like, look how cuddly. Look how cuddly she just. Oh, she is so sweet. Look, she just melts, melts right into you. I love it. Okay, I'll show you the. Oh, she's so sweet. Oh, okay, the adore doll. The adore doll. It's like this size. So she she can be like a preemie. This would be a preemie size. She is so cute. Oh, her face is so sweet. But yeah, she's not a realistic size of a toddler. I have a toddler. I'll be right back. I'll show you Zena. She is my one of my toddler girls. I'll be right back. <laughs> This is Dina. She's my toddler girl. Now see, she's a big girl. <laughs> she is a true, like her feet. It's how big. Oh, she's heavy. And she, I love the sculpt because they're so cuddly. Like so, like look, she wraps around you. Oh, she's, and she hugs you both ends. <laughs> I love the sculpt. The sculpt is okay. Where's I'll be back. I'll put the adore doll. Oh, she and she feels she feels like a real. I have to dress her in this, some summer clothes and put a passy on her so it doesn't look like she's like, like what you always come about. Sculpt is so sweet. Okay. Be right back. And this is the Adora toddler. <laughs> They're both so cute. But yeah, you can tell the Xena here is realistic and she isn't. She's still so sweet though. But Xena here, I love her. Look, this is how much. Oh, she's heavy now. <laughs> I can't hold her up like that for too long. She's actually heavy. I like them heavy. I like them realistic. And here's the adore doll. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Not a true. Not a true size at all. But she is so cute. Would you like to know her name very quickly? I'm going to go. I have things to do. But uh, her name is Hallie. Hallie Janessa. And Hallie Janessa is actually named after one of my kids. I asked her for permission if I could use and I asked my girl Hallie at school if I could use her name because it's so pretty. And she could totally look like a Hallie. She could totally be a Hallie Janessa. She is so cute, but yeah, not not a reborn at all. Just a cute, cute doll. Um, and then Hallie made me this. Isn't that so sweet? She's one of my schoolgirls. Here's her. 
I'm going to keep this forever. And when Hallie is like, when she's a grandmother, well, will I be, will I be alive? <laughs> okay, when Hallie gets older to be a mother, I'm definitely going to show her this. I need to add the dates in here and her grade level. I'll put that at the back. But I've done that before. I've had kids um, many, many years ago in grade two. The first year I taught 2002 up here in the north. And um, I was still teaching in that community since last year. And they're now all in their 20s and also parents. And I would show them, do you remember this? And they couldn't believe it. And they uh, shout out to all my school kids that I've had over the years. I miss you guys. So nice, sir. Um, Holly Janessa, she is so sweet. I will not be putting her on a reborn body. She is going to remain like this. Um, as for clothing for her, I mean, she might be able to fit into some newborn clothes. Uh, but, and I wonder if I'll ever want to take her hair down. Although it's so cute, I could always put it back up. I would love to spend some time with Zena today. And this is Camprian, my newborn girl with the messy hair. Oh, she's so cuddly. She is like perfect. I have some cleaning up to do. I have some laundry to do, vacuuming to do, you know, all the normal mom chores. So, this guys. Hope that you're having a great day. Thank you so much for watching. And until next time, bye guys. Love you. Match your hands. Match your hand, guys. Give me a high five. Love you. Bye guys. See you next time.